All right, love bugs. Let's see what's the current energy. What's currently going on? What do you currently need to know? What's currently going on? What does the collective currently need to know? Occupation and mature man. So a person that's working very hard. It, this is this is also a person that's occupying. There is a truth that's going to come from this individual about some change they want you that they want you to make with them. This person right here know you may have some sort of expectation of them, or this is a person that expects something from you. Um, I hear visitation. There, there could be a visitation, but there's something this person is working on, working on, and this is a person that may want you to work with them, I'm hearing, not against them. Let's see. There is a truth that's going to come from this individual. They could tell you a truth about a lie that they told you, something they deceived you on, something that, you know, they went through their experience. This person right here is studying a lot, reading a lot, researching a lot. Um, I'm here finding, they're trying to find something, figure out something, see something. This is a person right here, they've gotten a little extra gray hair or they're developing gray hair because of the situation and circumstances that's at hand. I hear the word karma. This person has has a lot to say to you a lot they want to say to you in such a short time this is also a person that may need you just to come i'm here like work with me there's a karmic situation this person wants you to work with them with and not work against them what's going on with this situation holy spirit this is a person that's been occupying working very hard at this karmic situation if it's a person involved it's something they may feel like you know they've gotten themselves into they could really use a helping hand they could really use your expertise they could use your level of skill they could use your knowledge they could use your wisdom to show them some truth to help them to to help them make a choice on which way they should or should not go all right oh yeah this is a person right here that they've let they they allowed their head to get the best of them. This 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 emperor is angry. They're upset. They're bothered. They're frustrated. This is a person right here. They've been trying to work on something, manifest something, but something is consistently getting in his or her way. This is a karmic situation. This person is trying to get out of that. Someone has made this person very angry, very mad. They could be at the point that they're very hostile. I hear the word hostility. They've been trying to be nice, trying to be kind, trying trying to work with the situation. This could be something going on at their job, but this person is irritated, highly irritable. Now, this is a person right here that the thing is, they want to let you know, look, I've been waiting on this good thing to happen. I'm waiting to hear back from this job. I've had this interview. I know, I, I know they're going to pick me, but I don't know what's going on. I hear a lot of static, y'all. Something or someone is working against this person and they know it. They're not fooled. They're not deceived. They know what's going on. They know who it is. For someone here, I can already tell you, this person wants to ask you, it could be your advice, but they could also want to ask you, would you work with me? Would you help me figure something out? Something is going on in this emperor's life and he or she knows it's not natural. It's coming from an unnatural, unclean place. All right, what does this emperor need to say to the collective? Yep, oh God. The feelings they used to have towards a situation, towards a person, they just don't. This is a person right here. They've gotten into a manipulative energy because they know someone has been trying to manipulate them. This person knows who has been playing with their emotions. Something here could, could have been heavy on him or her to make them respond a particular type of way. Irrational, emotional, like somebody's trying to make this person spaz out, flip out. Week out. They've been trying to keep their composure. They've been trying not to go up on the deep end. But someone is giving them a reason to spaz out. This emperor is angry. This is a person that knows that someone has been toying with them. Um, muppeting a situation. Pulling strings behind the scenes. Um, I hear the words help me. Let's see. What's going on? What's this help me about? Yep. See the center wall? This person has something on their back. They have a monkey on their back. They have hardship on their back. They have someone trying to make a situation hard. This could be spiritual warfare. If it is, that thing is, you know, they could really use your level of expertise, your skills to help them understand the spiritual warfare. But what I'm really hearing is somebody wants you to work with them to outsmart somebody. 
There's a karmic situation going on around this person. They're, they're in the known of it. But they want you to help them outsmart somebody. Work with me is what they're saying, not against me. Because it's already hard enough on them. So this is a person that could be trying to clear up something. Um, this card is inverted. It's not supposed to be. But they could be in the process of trying to clear something up. They're being this, He or she is being very discreet intentionally. Because they know people are working on them. Planning for their downfall. Hoping to set them up. Hoping to see them go through hardship. Whether it's you and them or just this person here. So this person is saying, help me sight this person out. We both, as somebody is saying, we both can come out on top. All right. See the seven of wands? This person right here is standoffish from anybody. You know, they, they've they been, they, they, this person has become a little guarded because they know someone or something is trying to like irritate them, come up, come up against them. This person has a plan. They want you to join them on their plan. Oh, excuse me. The Eight of Wands, this is a person, what they want to discuss with you is what they want to do, how they want to do it, or how they want to reverse psychology and or trick someone else. What's going on here? The Temperance card, the Six of Pentacles, yep. So this is what this person is saying. I need you to help me. Uh, a bird in the hand is better than a, better than a bird in the bush. They've been thinking about how they could execute this plan. Yep. And this person right here is like, look, I know this is manipulative energy. I know this seems tricky, but this is the only way I can do this. And I can still come out, from, come out on top. I'm in a situation. Can you help me? This situation involves other people trying to make my life hell, trying to cause me havoc, trying to cause me pain. What do you recommend? What should I do? Will you help me? I'm already down. I know they know I'm down, but I'm not down for the count. Someone here views you as their end all be all. So this is someone who's looking to speak to you from a place of loyalty. They know that you're loyal with them, that you care about them. You may not want to see them down or down and out. Somebody is coming up against this person. Now, it could be a spiritual force, but this looks like people or a person that's invoking or provoking some sort of spiritual force to cause a person hardship. So what your person is saying, help me work against this karmic or karmic energies. I hear set up this lover's card. Yeah, because this person has been stuck. They've been in limbo for quite some time. It's like nothing is moving forward in their life. It's not that more, it's not that so much of anything bad is going on, but it's not so much that anything good is happening. They're in neutral, but they know they're in neutral because somebody's behind the scenes pulling strings. And they're like, man, I'm I'm kind of wasting money. I'm losing money. Money I could be making. Somebody is playing with me. Someone is messing with me. So what this person is asking you is to team up, partner with me. Let's use your skills, my level of expertise. Let's put it together. Meet me in the middle. Let's compromise. Let's see what, what they want you to do as a magician. For those of you all, you wondering what's going on with my person, why... Are we in limbo? Why are things not um, working out? Why are we not doing anything? It's because they know someone is messing with their life. It could be their livelihood. So this person is saying, we got to strategize differently. See here? This person wants you to work with them to work against somebody else. But it's to fool somebody. It's to work in secrecy. It's to work in privacy. Or it's to come up with some sort of plan that is almost like it wants you to fake something out with them. Or some of you all... I'm here and throw them off. They need you to help them throw them off so they can go in a different direction. Someone is hot on this person's trail or hot on your trail or the both of y'all's trails. So they need some help. Like throw them off. Don't let them, don't let them know which way I'm going or help me see what they really know. This person wants you to have their back. The two of swords. Yep. The temperance card. In the three of swords, this person right here has been deceived. They've been, but they're bothered by this because see, someone here is trying to gain some sort of control over them or trying to control and manipulate them. I hear that song, If You Be My Bodyguard, I Can Be a Long Lost Pile. So it's almost like this person is saying, you know, let's come together. 
I'll, you know, um, I'll make sure it's beneficial for you. You know, I can give you something monetarily, but all I'm asking is to have my back. This could be temporary for some of you all. Others of you all, it could be, you know, a little, it could be something longer or long lasting. This is a person who's trying to move away from havoc, move away from karmic energies or a karmic person, but they want to be discreet. So I keep hearing team up. This person wants you to team up with them. That's an offer they want to give you. Excuse me, y'all, my, my nose is itching. That's an offer they want to give you to team up with them to work against a karmic person or a karmic situation. Yep, because see, everything they do, they're being watched. Now, this could be someone who, you know, may have a situation that you, of course, may know about. So, you know, they're being watched. But as they're being watched, delays are being created in their life. It's like someone here is intentionally creating or causing stumbles and blocks. So, this person is saying, what about your friends? Would they stand your ground? Would they let you down? This person is asking you, can you be a friend? Will you be a friend? If you can be a friend to them, they will return the favor and be a friend to you. But they need some help because they're getting a little weak in this situation. They've become a little vulnerable. They're getting a little tired and they're starting to get weary. They're not trying to shoot you in the crap, but their thing is, I keep hearing, just work with me. Because they got the devil on their back. <laughs> It got the devil on their back, honey. Now, this could be a devil of one person or a devil of a group of people. Unless it's a spiritual warfare. Someone here is also trying to beat the system and going to jail, if not prison. And that's the thing. They're trying to work hard to keep their head above water. And it's not that they're drowning, but it takes a lot to keep them leveraged. So, they're saying, is, okay, look. What do you need? How can I help you? Maybe we can help each other. This could also be family. A person wanted to come together with their family and say, let's help each other. Something here is if I hear all, there's some sort of all, some sort of fight, some sort of um, disturbance. This person has had some sort of disturbance in their life or they keep having little mini disturbances. Something to disturb their occupation, where they work, how they work. And they're like, I'm just, I'm just tired of this. I want to be done with this. I want to settle this. I need some help. So this is what they're saying. Will you help me? Maybe will you help me help you or help me help us or something like that? Close this out, Holy Spirit. The Six of Cups and the Devil card. Some of you all, you, this person, they're, they're coming towards you because wanting to have this conversation because they feel like you are the only loyal source that they have. The Six of Cups and the... um judgment card there's some sort of rapport that you all have and they feel like look i know you feel like i've been acting funny i have because something's going on in my life i can't really explain it i don't know how to explain it something could be you know out here like stalking me something could be going on with their mind also where someone's trying to drive them out of their mind but a person is doing this i think i'm using the correct word like someone is trying to invoke a person invoke an energy or provoke something to attack a person with this little ghost over here it's like they're seeing something But they know someone is trying to, they, they, they know, they know a person is doing this. So their thing is, look, can we, can we meet, can our common ground be loyalty? The six of cups, the judgment card. Can we be loyal to each other? Me and you, can we, can we partner up? Can we team up? Can I depend on you? I promise you can depend on me. This person is in a karmic situation, a karmic cycle, or fighting a karmic person slash karmic group of people. And what they want is for you to be able to team up with them, to fight with them and not against them. They could be at the point that they've gotten a little scared, gotten a little nervous, a little timid, you know, a little concerned because it's, it's constant. Somebody here constantly has a stumbling block. They're trying to get back to a place of contentment, being at peace. And it's like they, they, they know people are watching them. So they need somebody to be their eyes. They need somebody to cover their tracks for them or wipe away their tracks. Now, I'm going to say this because I see this. Now, this could be something possibly where someone here, you know, is, is up to something that could potentially be no good. And they need a extra person, extra partner for those that resonate with that type of energy. But somebody who needs some help. 
They, they need your level of expertise. They need your skill. They need your ability, if not spiritual gift. They don't trust everybody because they're ready. For, they're they're ready to take the situation and leave it in the past. But they're trying to. It's like they're playing dodgeball. They're ready to go above and beyond. They're ready to rise above the situation and leave it behind. They've been meditating and praying, and it's almost like for some of you all here, the more yep, the more they meditate and pray, the Lord keeps sending them your name, your energy, your spirit, your face, your picture. They know to come to you because you're that loyal one. You're that person they have true rapport with. That's like, okay, AEL subscriber never had any bad intentions towards me. I just need to level up with them and tell them what's really going on in my life or what I think going on. Somebody's afraid to open up because they feel like you will call them crazy or someone will call them crazy. Because they have like, it could be paranormal things going on around their home. Or somebody has a witch, a really dark witch doing a lot of dark spells to play on this person's psyche. So they're asking you, work with me against this karmic, karmic situation, karmic person, karmic cycle. Help me beat this person at their own game. Um, Capricorn, Aries, Sagittarius, Aries, and Gemini. Peace and blessing, great day. I hope this helps. Love you all so much. Namaste.